How to make the Luma fade transition. Today's video is sponsored by the Flat Earthers. Bring your second clip on top of your first one. Keep the overlapping part at the duration you want to make your transition. Cut the parts that are not overlapping. Select both of the cuts, make them a new fusion clip, and open the fusion page. Let me move the nodes, just to keep things cleaner. Select your second clip, and add a Luma Kia node. Right click to the low value and select to modify with Anim curves. Go to the modifiers tab, change the source to duration, set the curve to easing, the in and out to sign, and check the invert box. Change the time scale to 2, and go back to the tools tab. Right click to the high value, select to modify with Anim curves, and go to the modifiers tab. Change the source to duration, the curve to easing, the in and out to sign, and check the invert box. You made your Luma transition. If this is what you wanted, you can skip the rest of the video. Add a dent node. Change the type to sign dent. Increase the size to 1, right click to the strength slider, and select to modify with Anim curves. Go to the modifiers tab, change the source to duration, the curve to easing, the in and out to sign, check the invert box, and set the scale value to 2.5. Add a glow node, decrease the sign threshold, and adjust the spread value to your liking. Choose your desired color, right click to the gain slider, and select to modify with shake. Go to the modifiers tab, bring down the smoothness, and set the maximum slider to 1.5. Go back to the tools tab, right click to the opacity, and select to modify with anim curves. Go to the modifiers tab, change the source to duration, the curve to easing, the in and out to sign, and check the invert box. Set the scale value to 2, and your transition is ready. If you liked this clip, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, you can always go back to Windows Movie Maker.